previously on the Steve Saga. I have something in mind for you two. Move over by the machine. Demon Steve, keep an eye out on these two. Okay, okay we're gonna have to make a break for it. Demon Steve is guarding the front, so we're gonna have to go through the back. Okay, well, let's make sure he doesn't find us, because seriously, I think... I think he's gonna destroy us this time. Villains aren't always so obviously cut and dry. Sometimes, it isn't simply just an evil looking monster that hates all things good deep down to the bone. Things can be complicated. All the more reason for me to find my friends. That's right, the gang's getting back together. Cause, well, this, this is the Steve Saga. Upset. Uh, no, no, we should, we should be okay. You sure? Because like, I mean, he was like screaming off in the distance. It was very ominous. It was like he was, you know, speaking throughout the entire world just to get the message to us that he's upset. So I think he's upset, yeah. man. No? I think he's just working through things right now. Just uh, projecting, you know? Okay. Yeah. You think he's going to like work it out himself or? That's the hope anyways. I, I don't want to help him. Do, do you want to help him? Oh no, not at all. He's already betrayed okay. us again. Yet again. Yeah. Yet again. It's nothing but okay. betrayal. So yeah, that's that. Um, Guardian's gone. Don't know where he went. I mean, we know where he went, but I mean, well, we don't even know if he made it. Kind of know. Yeah. yeah. So we're hiding in a forest. The, the town is over there. Uh, can, we probably yeah. can't ever return to that. So that's, that's nope. a no-go from us. And now uh, Reality Steve is aware that we're gone. So what, what's, what's, uh, what, what do we, what, what's happening? What, like, what do we do here? Well, you know? I'd say find a better place. I don't like being right next to the town right now. You sure? What are the chances he's going to find us? I, I feel like- I found you, finally. You Very nice. Us. Yeah, Alex, we probably should have been running this entire- Oh, oh, oh hey, Reality Steve. Hey there, buddy, uh, buddy. Hey, uh, so For you know. So long. Yeah, exactly. You know, I just want to tell you something before you, you know, get ahead of yourself and jump to any conclusions that are unnecessary. The demon Steve let us out of his own accord. He actually broke us out. He's. It was so nice of him. I know. You know, really? he, he. Well, I mean, it wasn't nice of him because look, we were just trying to stay in those machines, you know, because we were doing well, as yeah, you said. We're just just follow, follow your order. And yeah, then he was like, you know what? You guys don't need to be in the machines. And I was like, wow, great. But, no, uh, no, no, he doesn't talk. You can't, you can't. Uh. He doesn't talk, Alex. You two left the town and betrayed my trust. Wait, Wait. there was trust? What? Wait. There was you're, trust? What trust? Yeah, well, there was no trust. What do you Wait, mean? You, you mean? locked you us up us in inside of a machine. And you locked us in... What? That doesn't... I don't understand why... Where? When? Since when did you think there was trust? We didn't even trust you. Even when we had you in a machine. You two are so annoying and I'm going to destroy you right now. I'm not putting you in a machine. I'm not going to take you back to the town. I'm going to right here on the spot destroy you. Do you have any last words? Um... Alex, you go first. Oh. Um... Well, yep. Uh huh. I I hope Guardian is okay. Speak faster. Uh, we've been really good friends, and I really appreciate everything that you've ever done for me. And I just hope Galaxy Steve can work this all out. Wow, that means a lot. Well, that's gonna put to shame what I was gonna say, so I'm just not gonna say anything. Well, if that'll be all, then here we go. Goodbye to the both of you. If I can't have another world, I'll make this world mine, and you two are the only ones standing in my way. So. Take this. Uh, what? What's happening? Why can't I? Get out of my head! No. No, I control both of us. You need to leave my mind now. Get out of here. I don't under- Wait, it sounded like he had like diarrhea and then he stopped. It was he- Hey! It almost sounded like he was trying to sneeze. And then <laughs> yeah, almost actually, huh? Yeah. yeah. What's going on? He's just over there freaking out. Are you- Are hey, you Hey, buddy. Uh, Yo, oh, wow. He's freaking out. Normally, we don't mind. No, but, uh, I will do oh. this on my own. Now you leave me alone and get out of my head. Why are you even here? I absorbed you perfectly fine. And now you come back. What is the meaning of this? Wait, is he talking about Galaxy Steve? Is Galaxy Steve inside of his mind right now fighting back? 
Is he talking to him? Both of you silent! I'm trying to figure all of this out. I don't know what's happening, but you... You... Both of you just stay right there. I don't understand uh, where you... Oh, oh, uh, oh, oh, he's oh. flying away. Oh, oh, okay. So... Well, that was close. Well, yeah, actually, that was close. I'm glad we dodged that bullet, huh? Yeah. Yeah, uh, it was a... Good job on us. I know, right? We did a good job there. Although, I do have to say something, Alex. Yes. I don't think we did anything there. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I mean, literally nothing. Like, we were literally saved by luck. I have no idea. I mean, it seemed like Galaxy Steve was in his head fighting back. So, I, I guess we owe it to Galaxy Steve. He saved us, despite being absorbed, which is... Wait a second. I get it. Galaxy Steve was being so overpowered because of the amount of energy that Reality Steve held in his... Well, in his control. So, once we stole basically like half that power and gave it to you, which, by the way, we should probably not forget about that. You literally have a bunch of power right now. But, either way, you have power now. And so, since Reality Steve doesn't have as much as he did before, and he doesn't know it, Galaxy Steve is able to fight back. He's more prevalent in his mind. Wait, wait. Yep. yep. Absorbed Galaxy you're, Steve. Yeah, you're piecing it together. Uh huh. Yeah. Yep. Had, had all the power. Had all the power. Galaxy uh, Steve was stuck thing, at the back of his mind. There. Yeah, tree yeah. over there. Yep. Uh huh. Yeah. Okay. I have mine. You have some so of your power back. Galaxy Steve. Okay. Okay. You yeah. got it? I'm following. Yeah, you're following? I got it. Okay. Yep. All right. So you're picking up what I'm putting down. What? Great. Go ahead and pick up what I'm putting down. There you go. Doing good. Doing good uh, out there. So I have a question. You. Yeah, no problem. Yes. Uh, should we go to the town and try and uh, do something about what just happened? I know I just recently, as in literally like a few minutes ago, said that we shouldn't go back to the town. But I'm starting to think that, you know, we have some higher chances at actual survival if we go back there and maybe try and get, you know, Galaxy Steve to fight back. Galaxy Steve has been stuck inside of someone else's head before, too. And if you hear Galaxy Steve in your head, would you not want to go crazy? That's a fair point. Exactly. Is, uh, yeah. Plus, he's already done it before, like I said, so. He already knows what to do. Wow, man, he... We've all been through a lot together. And yeah. separate. Just all... Yeah. It's just a mess. Okay, well, let's go check out the town. Yeah, this is the right plan, right? Going back to the town and, uh, and, and looking in and kind of figuring out what's happening, right? Uh, it's really the only plan. Yeah, uh, as a matter of fact, you're right. Yeah, I had no other plan, so I guess this is it, even so though... it's the best and the worst, really. Yeah, I mean, we're going back to the one place that's probably the most likely of us getting absolutely wrecked. Unless we get lucky again. That could happen. Oh, oh, oh there he is. He's right in there. Oh. He's right in there. Yeah, I was going to say, I saw him fly in this direction, so I'd assume that he's over here. Okay. Let's go up. Let's go up here and look in. Okay, Alex, first of all, we're going in on an undercover spy mission, okay? Do you oh. think you can handle it? I've always wanted to do that. Yeah. Okay, cool. All right. So the first step to being a spy is, uh, well, hang on. I keep, sometimes I forget. Uh, is it, I think you got to be a, as loud as possible and yell like a maniac. Is that, what? is that how that works? I don't know if that's how that's supposed to go. Okay. I, I can try. No, wait, 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 wait. Hang on. No, I just realized. No, we have to be oh. as quiet as possible. Oh, okay, that makes more sense. Yeah, 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 yeah. Good thing we figured that out beforehand, huh? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, okay. I, I feel like that might have alerted him. No, 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 I, I think we're good. I think we're good. Where is he? Okay. He's, okay. Oh, no, no, look. See, he's panting back and forth, and I think he's more worried about himself he's, at the moment. Yeah. The, yeah. yeah what yeah, what yeah, did I say, panting? Or why did I say yeah, panting? Yeah, the word, I don't know. It's pacing. The word, the word is pacing. Yeah, good yes. call. Good call, Alex. See, that's why, yeah, you're, you know, you gotta, you're... Trusty, you're, you're, you're being, tr you're, you're trustworthy. I'm gonna just turn around. Okay, let's see here. It looks like he's freaking out, breaking blocks. I think he's really angry. Maybe we can hear him say something. I don't know. Let's, let's get a little closer. Oh man, he does not look happy. Then again, when has he looked happy, huh? Yeah, not, not ever really. I told you, get out of my head. I'm going to move forward with this plan, whether you like it or not. The fact that you're even able to speak to me is. Well, it's worrisome enough. I need to figure this out. I was about to destroy them and you wouldn't let me. Now get out of my head! He's talking about Galaxy Steve, right? He has to be. If he is, then we should probably try and help Galaxy Steve out. I mean, Galaxy Steve is holding him off on his own inside of his head. And, well, I mean, he's doing a good job of that. He's, pre he's pretty much used to that. You know, he's already been stuck in someone's head, so he's done you, this you're before. You're going to have to explain that to me later, because I'm not sure what you're talking about. Oh, right. Yeah. It's, uh, it's complicated. It, 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 you know, all, all I need to tell you is he has also been stuck inside of someone's head. And, uh, well, he figured that one out, too. So he's he's fighting. Okay. He's, he's done this before. He's practiced. Should we approach him? Should we try and get Galaxy Steve to, like... Uh I'm worried. What if Reality C freaks out even more and then just attacks us on the spot? I mean, Galaxy C was barely able to hold him off as soon as we were about to be destroyed, so would it be safer or more dangerous to approach? We might be the catalyst that Galaxy Steve needs. Yeah. 
We would be the caterpillar that Galaxy Steve needs. You're right. I'm telling you, if you don't get out of my head, I will go out of my way to destroy you completely. Leave willingly now. Uh, we should probably approach. I think now is yeah, the time to I approach. Think, yep, now is... 360! Oh! oh. Alright, let's do this. Come on. Hey, Reality Steve, how you doing, man? Thought you ran away from us earlier. Thought we'd comfort you. Just kidding. This isn't a visit to comfort you. It's more of to comfort Galaxy Steve, who's inside of your head. Ha! Ha! Ah, am I right? This is none of your business. Now leave me. I thought, I thought you wanted to destroy us, huh? Yeah, I I thought you just wanted to get rid of us. You yeah, what's right wrong? right there, and then Galaxy Steve, he just, just held you back. Hey, Galaxy Steve, can I talk? Oh, right, you're still stuck inside of Reality Steve's head, so I guess I can't talk to just you for a second. Galaxy Steve, fight back, man. Fight back. Get out of there, man. Come on. Give him a good old one-two. Mentally, though, of course, because you're still stuck inside of his head, so I guess you couldn't really actually give him the one-two. You know what a one-two is, right? Uh, I one, have an idea. Two. Yeah, 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 okay, yeah, 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 I, got yeah, yeah. I got it. Leave now. Your friend is still inside of my mind, and I will destroy him if you don't leave me alone. But I'm if you destroy him, that's destroying part of you, isn't it? Oh, that was deep. That's actually very true. That is none of your business, like I say. I have figured out how to be able to get rid of him. I just need to do so without hurting myself. It's easier than you would think. No, once I do this, I will destroy you. You got lucky that Galaxy Steve is holding me back. He seems to have a much stronger will than I initially thought. Well, it's not just that. Actually, wait, we probably shouldn't tell him about the other thing, right? No, no, don't, don't mention okay, that. Okay, yeah, we won't. What other thing? That you smell! Boom! That was, that was good. Thank was you. Good yeah, it was a good segue, am I right? No, but seriously, um, I have, I have a new, um, perpetual motion for you. Proposition. That was the word. Proposition for you. And this time, it's actually going to be a good thing. Think about it. Okay, Galaxy Steve is stuck inside of your head. Okay, Reality Steve, yeah? Right? Yes, he is. Not for long, though. Now, how about this? How about we help you extract Galaxy Steve, and then you go live your life on your own, okay? You don't have to take over the world, man, okay? You haven't really done anything that's permanent, well, that we know of, that's permanent and can't be reversed, okay? You can still change, all right? As a matter of fact, when we put you in that machine, I made it so that you could keep living your life after we took everything out, well, all the powers out of you and everything. So, for the record, I wasn't gonna destroy you, okay? I just wanna go on the record and say that, although I probably should have, huh? Yeah, but let, let's move past that right now. Moving let's past that. With the, with the proposition. Thank you, Alex. The proposition is that I think we can separate you and Galaxy C properly with the current machines we have. I mean, I'm probably gonna have to change them around a little bit. Actually, a lot bit. A good amount. Really good amount. But we can separate you guys, and it won't hurt either of you. I'm telling you. The longer you put this off, or even if you do destroy Galaxy Steve within yourself, probably not gonna be a good thing for you, man. You think you figured it out, but you also thought you figured out how to leave this world, and you freaked out, and then you came back, and you shut down, and then you're like, ooh, wow, I'm so scared now. That's you, that was you. That was a good, uh, that was a good imitation, right? Uh, that's as close as you're gonna get. Okay, wait, was that, was that an insult? No. Well, there you go. That's my pancake. What do you think? What I think is that I'm going to deny all of that and destroy Galaxy Steve right now. This video is sponsored by MC Pro Hosting. That's right, MC Pro Hosting, your friendly neighborhood server hosters. If you guys need your own personal server, whether that's Minecraft Java Edition, Minecraft Pocket Edition, or even, I, I mean, I guess Minecraft Windows 10 Edition, but that's Pocket Edition, it's kind of the same thing. So I guess that doesn't, yeah, you know what I mean. Then don't forget to check out MC Pro Hosting down in the description below and click the link and use code FAVORMYSAVER for 25% off for any server that you can get on their website. They have servers for even non-Minecraft games. I've personally been using MC Pro Hosting for years now and they've always been super reliable, super amazing, and seriously guys, I can't suggest them enough. They have partnered with me and sponsored this video, but I do personally suggest that you guys do check them out if you want to actually get a server. Thanks again to MC Pro Hosting for sponsoring this video. As always, I'm your host Saber and I have indigestion.